it does not feel like spring out here right now. Look, a big patch of snow right next to me. We're right off of Artist Road up here in Santa Fe. The elements are starting to pick up a little bit and people are expecting them to only get worse. We were surprised. We were definitely surprised. Caught us off guard. Yep. It's April 28th. Like, what is going on? Molly Malone isn't happy about the icy spring. She's a theater student at the New Mexico School of the Arts, getting ready for her senior project. But you're supposed to have a performance tonight and tomorrow evening, but they got canceled. There's a lot of people who like live in the dorms and like commute from like Las Vegas or Taos or like places like that. And so it's really difficult and they didn't want people like driving. Others concerned about the plants around their homes. And there's a lot of fruit trees still and so those are gonna take a hit yeah uh, not necessarily because of the snow because of the over low overnight temperatures after it's cold enough you can see my breath <sighs> not good conditions if you planted flowers for springtime so it just takes a little bit of good planning um, getting the roots established um, mulching to keep them warm Thomas Clark says he's been gardening for decades and he's pressing his luck blossomed early enough that they might be hardy enough I don't know for sure we might have some problems but you know today it snowed a lot and none of the branches came down and to see if these flowers on the side of the road will survive this cold snap well it's in the hands of mother nature and if you have plot potted plants, bring them inside tonight, or you can use a tarp or a sheet to put over them. Live in uh, Santa Fe tonight, Justin Matthews, KOAT Action 7 News.